Today, I'm gonna be taking my best friend Davey Gravy oh. on an all expenses paid vacation to Sweden. The only catch is me and Gravy are from Alabama. As Southern boys, men, we're not particularly fond of the cold, but Gravy, Gravy despises the cold. If it's below 50 degrees, he's not looking at a fishing pole, much less filming with me. So I booked a trip halfway around the world to the Arctic Circle, where we're gonna be sleeping in a room made completely of ice to prove that you can have fun in the cold. Oh, hold on. Hold on! Don't be scared of the break, Gravy! Oh, 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 oh Gravy! Alright. Ah, lift with the back. Oh gosh. Yeah. Triple hernia coming. Uh huh. Body bag first. Body bag first. All right. It's all you. Dear Lord, what are you doing in there? Oh, the full body. Now me? You good, sir. Oh, hey, I'm in here. Oh my gosh, she's tight. She's very tight. All right, go ahead, Gravy. All right. Oh, 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 oh. Bro, yep, yep, yep. Oh, yep. Very That's narrow. Right. Sorry about that. Oh, man. Good, man. Thank you. Thank you. We'll have try fun to. Well. <laughs> There's a blockage here, and we have a lot. stream on us. Yeah, we, um, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're from America. <laughs> Oh yeah! Watch the elbows. She's getting tighter. Patrick. Gosh. Yeah. Okay, I'm taking a seat. Ah. You know, when they said four beds, I was expecting a little, a little bit more room. <laughs> oh, not good. We ought to have somebody screaming. That's your favorite. Gravy loves crying babies. I love crying babies with no soundproof walls. He will just look at a mother who's just drenched in night sweat and saggy <laughs> eyes because she's been loving and caring on the new generation of humans. And he'll say, what the heck is going on? <laughs> Shut that thing. Hello. Hey. Hello. <laughs> ah, that was definitely a mother. God, that is unfortunate timing. That was very bad timing. All right, I'm getting the bag. All right, Gravy, last one. Oh Don't my gosh. Oh, oh, yeah, okay. Ah, okay. Flip with the body. Okay. Yeah. Ah. Oh my God. Is that ladder? It's supposed to be a ladder? Don't worry about it, sweetheart. It's my mother's luggage case. If you're wondering. <laughs> you have anything fragile in here? No, no, no. I'll just close. Swear? Just close. Ah. <laughs> 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 Okay, she moved. Uh, 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 Same about my bag. Is it not? It's a family member's bag. Whose bag? <laughs> I think it's my dad's. I don't know if it's using the board. Sorry, Mr. Owen, I will buy you a new bag. <laughs> From Sweden. Gravy, welcome to your $150 a night per person overnight European Arctic train. We're gonna do a little room reveal for you guys really quick. This room is roughly, I would say, a Davy Gravy and a third, if you don't believe me. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, Wait, flat back. Uh, <laughs> All right, that's one gravy, and that's about a third. Oh, All right. Okay. At the lower level of our car, we have two couches, basically. I saw these hinges on the wall, and I was like, dude, I wonder if we have three beds. Okay. Oh, okay. There's a ladder. There's a ladder below. Jesus. <laughs> We have six beds in here total, which is news to me. Okay. Oh, oh wow. Okay. <laughs> you can put it all on me. Okay, I'm up here. They have kind of a bunk bed set up, which I'm not gonna lie, for back home, you get a hotel for 150, 200 bucks. This hotel, you get free food, and you move across an entire country. The one thing I've noticed since I've been here is these folks love to run their heat. This room, Oh, okay. You can get all the fresh air you want. I feel like this is how you get your arm ripped off, just reaching out of a train window. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yep. Whoa. Funny how that happens. <laughs> Hello. Ah, must have been a bullet train. I believe there is a bathroom somewhere. A bathroom? But I feel like it's a public use bathroom. So oh. we have to share with other people. Oh. We got some uh. Swedish people. What's right. happening here? Don't you worry about a thing. <laughs> She's moving down. And then. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> All right, and that is the bottom bunk. For 150 bucks, I'm saying this is a steal. And this is just the beginning. You just wait. You're fixing to love some cold weather, brother. Oh. I'm fixing to call you up. You're going to say, dude, it's 32 degrees. 
You bet I want to throw a deep water crankbait. We're going to go see what the dining cab is all about. Excuse me. What is this? Oh, okay. Little pit stop on the way to the dining room. We have our bathroom. Oh, smells horrendous. No, dude. For the next 16 hours, this is going to be our bathroom. We have a toilet. <laughs> you flush it like this. <laughs> but the sink. Okay. Another button. You press it. Gosh, it's a little bit of water. There's a sign that says not drinkable. Not drinkable, so you're not drinking water. Ah. Jeez, the place it smells like urine in there. Like, okay, she's bouncing hard. <laughs> oh, there's this dining cabin. You gotta sit down with me? After you. Oh. How are you? Hey. Wow. Uh, well, we have the. Have a taste of Norland here. Lasagna. Okay. Kick cart. Kick cart. Grita. Grita. She's right, right here, right here. I kind of think that's gonna be. That's me. Move. That's me. Or, or what is this? It's a built soda. It says 25% blabber. I don't know what blabber is. We blabber enough. <laughs> is this reindeer? Uh, no, those are moose, and this is with reindeer. This is moose, and that's reindeer. Yes. I've never done it before. What is this? Do you know? It's a blueberry soda. Blueberry soda? We'll do it. Do you have your own bottle opener? Do you want me to open it? We did not have our own bottle opener. Okay, I will open it. If dangerous. you have, it's easy to carry, but I can open it otherwise. Okay. I'll take the charge just carrying it. It's all good. I hope y'all have a cleaning crew. Thank you. Thank you so much. Nice, nice. We'll see you in like an hour, probably. Ah, <laughs> oh, dang it. Oh. Sometimes you feel like they can't understand you and they understand everything. They just talk about you in a different language. Blueberry soda. Let's try it out. Wow. She really tastes like true blueberries. Is it good? All right. Can I try that soda? Sure. Yeah. Gosh dang it. Ah, oh, that's going to taste like... It's, 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 it, I don't know it's how it's going to hit you. Yo. Alrighty. Let's start out with the reindeer. Start out with the reindeer? Yeah, they look like dog what, treats. There's a total of three here, yeah. What are we grabbing, like one a piece or two a piece? Whatever or... makes your heart happy. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, mm. I, I nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> we'll go in. All right. <laughs> Cheers. Okay. Make buying the sausages. You must eat some really old vinyl sausages. It kind of tastes like whenever you get really curious in middle school and you want to try a dog treat when your mom's not home. You've done that before, haven't you? No. Don't lie to me. Wanted to, but never have. When do it when we get home? Let's see what the moose is all about. Give a smell of that. Gosh, it smells like you ripped from to one on the toilet. <laughs> they look identical. A lot softer, not as tough. Yeah. A lot softer meat, more fat. This is a wrap. Bro, that tomatoes on there. I don't like tomatoes. You don't like tomatoes? No. Oh, it said lasagna, and I use lasagna pan. Unless your mom makes it. Wait a minute. She makes some good lasagna. Before. Yeah, she <laughs> makes some good lasagna. Yeah. Before we completely turn all you guys off to watch the rest of this video, we're going to throw down, and then we might get in bed. Oh, Jesus. Excuse me. Before we go any further, today's video is brought to you by Factor. Factor makes meeting your nutrition goals easier than ever by delivering fresh, never frozen, dietitian approved meals straight to your doorstep. No matter what's on your schedule, Factor has a bunch of different options to keep you going. They have snacks, breakfasts, juices, wellness shots, lemon, apple, ginger, honey, turmeric, black pepper. Wow. That's pretty, it's good, but I mean, it packs a punch. And boy, am I feeling well. With Factor, you have over 35 different meals to choose from every single week. <laughs> they got different diets. If you're a keto kind of guy, low calorie, vegan. <laughs> I'm cracking down on the old Chipotle queso chicken. Prep time with these things is literally two minutes. Put her in the old microwave. Two minutes. Already prepped meals that are fresh, 
prepared by some gourmet chefs. Ship straight to your house. Two minute prep time in the microwave. Don't have to spend a ton of time in the kitchen or the grocery store and you got fresh meals. So if you would like, you can click the link in the description or go to factor75.com. Use code AO50 to get 50% off your first box. Woo! That's factor75.com. Link in description. Code AO50, 50% off your first box. Thanks, Factor. Now back to Sweden. This could have been useful earlier. All of our bedding is on the very top of the storage. All right, your stuff's coming down, brother. Oh yeah, a pillow. A pillow. Oh my gosh, a pillow. Yeah, yeah. A pillow. Yeah. <laughs> I can feel where the arms of this chair are what? in my lumbar. There she is. Okay, this is not as bad as I thought it would be. Okay, now we should have lights off. On a one to 10 scale, how would you rate the overnight train bed? She feels pretty good. I'd, I'd, I'd give her a easy passing grade of like a 80. 80? Okay, we'll see if that holds overnight. I don't feel like I'm bunched up. Like, yes, in a fall. I would agree with that. I will say from a spacious standpoint, pretty comfortable. Yeah. I can feel where the armrests are, so my back's a little jarred. Me and old gravy. We're gonna see how it is to sleep on an overnight train. I'm also being really loud. They just got that baby to sleep. We'll let you guys know how sleeping on a train is. Just a second. you doing you gonna latch in your latch up there i'm a stiff man gravy on one to ten i say probably about a seven of sleep which is pretty good yeah she slept well i, I feel like i slept through a lot of different stops so the train didn't wake up yeah there's somebody coughing halfway through the night <coughs> like they were dying did y'all hear that yeah i did hear that i will say there's more snow outside than i've ever seen in my entire life gravy yeah Look, we're at Santa's workshop right now. It I does feel. look like we're we're in Santa, Santa's downtown. <laughs> and did we just get the news that we have to change trains completely? Gotta bring out the big Larrys too. We're just getting started, buddy. I, I apparently I don't know so. Why you're putting gloves on. <laughs> we're just changing trains. Uh, yeah, I don't even have thermals on. I'm already feeling it. It's already coming in hot. I don't even know what you're talking about, buddy. We're not even there. So we just exited the Ligvong. We're about to hop on a train to Karuna. We have about 14 minutes till our next train. We have not layered up. <laughs> There's no way it's above zero right now. Uh, it's below, no doubt. We got five more hours of training and then we're not training again the rest of the trip. Me and Gravy have made it to the ICE Hotel. The power is out. No power. It's like negative eight outside. A lot of other people in here though. Yeah, there is. What are Some they body heat's going up. <laughs> it really is. What do they estimate that they might get power back? I don't know. Woo! As you may can tell, the power is back on. It's good news. Amazing news. We made it. How are you feeling? <laughs> Better that we have power for now. There's a slight line to check in right now, but we're about to go explore the ice hotel itself. And I'm so excited to look around here. I hope that's not his room. Yes, we'll check, check, check. What's that? That's somebody. That's all right. Locked up. Anybody home? Yep, stop that. <laughs> That's us. I'm gonna try it. If you guys are wondering where we are, we've made it to the Arctic Circle, one of the coldest places, if not the coldest place on the planet that humans are allowed to go to right now. Basic premise behind this thing. I know there's been a ton of other videos on YouTube about this specific hotel, but they take 600 tons of ice from the river down there called the 
Tournay River. Tournay River. They have a bunch of different sculptors and artists apply, and then a select few get to come and design these winter masterpieces, these ice rooms. Then they melt every single spring. So we get to come and see a fresh set of ice that's never graced YouTube before. And there might be like two future ice sculptors in the making. This man's gonna love the cold. You get the honors, good sir. Ah. Oh. Pusher. Ah. Ah. This. Oh, oh my gosh. My gosh. <laughs> wow. This is like a that face looking at you as soon as you walk in. Is that an octopus? That's interesting. It kind of freaks me out. I don't know if I like that either. It kind of looks like an octopus arm is reaching out of the wall. <laughs> Okay, we got a big arch. So everything here in Sweden is reindeer because they have fur rated for this temperature. These columns look ridiculous, dude. All right, absolutely. Yeah, we probably shouldn't do that. I wonder how they get that. I don't know if it starts with the ice like coming off of the sculpture. It's almost like, like somebody's getting prepared to get married. It's like a wedding plan oh, or yeah, something yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Should we try the bed out? I imagine so. Okay. Oh, wow. Uh, uh, okay. That's pretty comfortable. Oh, she's a little chilly. I would say to the designers of this room, i give you a solid six. What would you give them? I'd give them a ten. Pretty impressive. You're so right, and I am so sorry to Nando and Lilia. Oh. Uh, yeah, where are the restrooms in this place? I believe there's a door right there. Oh. What the heck? Wow. All right, so we are equipped not only with the coldest room, but- Wow, I might spend the night here, it's very warm. Our personal sauna, shower, and a moose rack in case you have a big itch down deep in your soul. All right. Oh, there's your private toilet. There we go. No peeing in the room. For the love of no the 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 There's no hiding up. The back. All gravy drinks is Coke, so if we try to pee in the room, there's no hiding it. It's gonna be like a, a brick of yellow. Alrighty, gravy. So the Ice Hotel, they have provided us with this bag to survive the night in here. Now, if you don't know this, you can get hyperthermia, sleeping below 32 degrees, your body temp will go down and you die. What does that mean? Like you're not living anymore. In this bag, they've given us everything we need to survive in 20 degrees tonight in a room built completely of ice. Is that a pair of panties? How? I mean, where did the legs go? Boom. Double layer. Layered up. That is perfect. We have some linens. I believe this is the inner lining of a sleeping bag. Yes, sir. This will go inside of your sleeping bag. Hold okay. on to this, good sir. Okay. Ooh. Okay. You got high painting again. And this is a Swedish made sleeping bag. Only your face will show when you're in here. Only your face. Rated for negative 25 degrees. She empty? That is all they're giving us, brother. We're going to go try out the bathroom facilities, try to warm up good as we can. We have a little Swedish send-off for 2023. Whoa. Okay. All right. What is the Swedish send-off? It's like... Oh, oh, okay. All right, now that we know what we're sleeping with, uh -huh. we got to enjoy the shower and the sauna. All right, but before that, what do we got to do? We got to do the Arctic. Circle. Bare, barefooted circle Polar race. plunge. It's only negative 10 degrees. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Three, two, one. Ah! Yes, sir. Oh, she's chilly on the feet. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. Here we go. Oh, how are you good at this? Oh, oh. It's far enough. Okay, watch out, camera guy. The feet need hot water on them. Oh, she's chilly. Ow. Slow down, slow down, slow down. <laughs> w, baby. Hey, I got the W. It's the first one to the wall. Ow, ow, okay, ow. we need hot water on the feet ASAP. Yeah. All right. Got our friend. Oh. Oh. That is insane how cold that gets. Whoa. Oh, my oh, 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 gosh. Like rare. Got my toboggan. Come on. So apparently there's like a Swedish tradition to welcome the new year in. 
they light these things. You light them on fire and they're gonna float up in the air. Back home, me and Gravy are used to welcome in the new year. We, we put the coat decorate bottle, Christmas trees and burn down. them down and we shoot a bunch of fireworks and stuff. Here in Sweden, everybody likes sky lanterns. Say, thank goodness 2023 is over. Oh my God. Whoa, okay, okay what are we doing? Okay. Happy New Year's, Gravy. Jeez. We are the worst tourists ever. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing here. I don't trust holding the fire put it on near the where the put fire it on the is. Put it on the ground. 2024 is our year. Well, um, put these fires out. What do we do? Stomp her out. Yeah. It's stuck in my shoe. Okay, so I'm on the ground too now. All right, all right. That's not a very good start to 2024. Happy New Year. Man. I don't know what the heck we're supposed to do with that, but Happy New Year. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. Get inside on the balloon. All right, I'm inside. All right. Is that how it's supposed to be? Put them in there. Okay. All right, don't, what are you doing? What are you doing? Get over there. The camera's on. What is happening here? You threw it back on me. Do I, I wasn't trying to. So I bet not you do it to me, so it's a little payback. Is any of this usable? Oh yeah. We've made it into our negative 25 degree rated sleeping bags. The few rules that we were given for sleeping in the ice hotel. Number one, they said one layer of thermals. Number two, they said don't breathe inside of your sleeping bag. The number one thing that gets people cold is when they get sweaty or when there's humidity built up and there's any type of liquid, it can get you messed up. Would you say on a one to 10 that you're beginning to enjoy the cold more? Yeah, but I don't know if I'm a sleeping bag man. I don't know how to operate a sleeping bag very well. It's like a biological yard sale. Happy New Year's. Ladies and gentlemen, this is probably a couple months late, but hope 2024 is good to you. We're gonna try to get some shut eye. We'll let you know if anything goes haywire. It is like a deep coldness. I'm breaking rules and I'm breathing in my sleeping bag. <laughs> and I believe we're gonna make our way to the sauna. Try to warm up. Ah. Uh, oh wow. <laughs> She's opened it up. Oh, yeah. Yep, that's her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, what's this? Oh, oh yeah. Oh. oh, my gosh. She's chilly more than a chilly willy, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, dude. Yeah. We've officially survived the ice hotel. It's negative 10 degrees outside. It's 20 degrees in here. It's warmer outside. Negative is better. Mm -hmm. and we have a date with some dog sledding dogs. Dog sledding dogs and Georgia Bulldogs. <laughs> oh, dude. These dogs are gonna struggle to pull me. <laughs> they look so tiny. They do. Good morning, guys. Morning. Hey. So, when you're driving, you stand on that runners, and it's almost the same like skiing. If you haven't all the time straight knees, a bit more bended. We have, in total, three brakes. This is like my handbrake. We have that scooter mat here, that's speed control brake. Then we have a main brake, that's that one here. With that one, we're stopping the whole team. The dogs are pretty skillful during the run. They're doing a lot of things while they're running. Like pooping and peeing. Oh. Yes. Oh, yeah, I if love it. If you noticed, <laughs> if you see that there's for a longer time a slack in the line, to avoid that they're getting tangled, slow down as well. You ready to do this thing, brother? We've been waiting our whole lives. Oh, they're doing it. Oh, that is. Oh, we need some help. We also got a lesson in the gift of life. Watch out for the poop ahead. My boys are ready to party. Oh, step on the brake, gravy! Out, brake! 
<laughs> Wasn't it? Oh, what, the one two at the hard. I didn't know it. I didn't know it. Robert, that's my bad. Okay, go. Come on, gravy! Oh, ah. oh my gosh! We're moving! Oh! Okay! Oh, wow! Yeah! Come on, baby! Why'd they give me only three dogs? I'm the fattest man here! Come on, guys! You gotta want it! You gotta want it! Oh, my eyes are freezing shut right now. That's a problem. Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> oh, we're tangled. Hey! Gravy just took a detour. Hey, stop! Stop! Hey, ho! Oh, hold on, buddy! It's been a wreck! <laughs> We're in a traffic jam. Somebody was walking a poodle and Gravy's dogs tried to take it to Pound Town, baby. You good? Good? All right, all right. Here we go. Don't do it. She's not worth it. Oh. <laughs> Run, Gravy! Gravy's down. <laughs> Sorry, I had a bump in the Yes, ma'am? Sorry. All right, let's go. This is so gorgeous. Come on, guys. Quit smelling all the pee. We can smell each other's pee when we're done racing. Where's the ale? <laughs> Do I? Holy cow. Where's does want that? Oh my gosh. Hello. Oh, by my head. Oh, these dogs are going the right way. They gave me three dogs. I'm the largest human being in this entire group. I had three dogs. So we have mushroom soup gravy. Mushroom soup, big mushroom fan. I'm, Are I'm you? a hot fan at this point, anything hot. That's amazing. So the whole distance, I'm not sure if Patricia already told you, the whole distance is about 11 miles, roughly 11 miles, so about uh, 17k. Our next destination, like I said, will be our kennel. It's shorter. <laughs> takes us just about 25 to 30 minutes. It will be way more bumpy, way more up and down, it's way more curvy. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Outstanding. We just stopped in a little cabin in the middle, I believe we're 11 miles from where we started. We had dinner with a really nice couple from the UK. And you picked up a new passenger right here? But he's, he's trying dogs. to get love on again. I have again. four dogs now, and they're still trying to go to pound and pound. <laughs> Hey dude, come on dude. <laughs> we have 25 minutes left. We're headed to the kennels to see where these things live. I think Gravy's falling in love with the cold. Nah, I don't know about don't that. Don't let him lie to you. <laughs> He's loving this. I'm loving dogs. Whoa. Hey, come on. <laughs> All right, thank you. Oh yeah. There's a difference in three and four dogs, baby. And I like it. Holy cow. Wow. We're on the move. Wow. Right, right. I will say, not our typical AO fishing shenanigans, but this is a really fun experience. My eyelashes are freezing. My eyes shut. But it's been really cool to experience something this wild with you guys. Hudson, Hudson, you're the leader of the, of the captain. Hey, shut up. Run. What are you doing? And Hutchie's a mean old woman. Holy smokes. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Okay. 
Oh, oh, God, there, there. Oh, yeah, there we go. Full head of steam. <laughs> Don't be scared of the brake, gravy. Oh, hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Oh, hold on. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, my lanta. Oh, she's getting seen. Oh, sh oh, God. Oh, oh, sh oh, oh, sh oh, 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 Oh God, what the mirror? <laughs> oh, crazy! Stop! Oh, you okay? <laughs> We're all good. You? No, 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 no. Yeah, I'm good. You good. Good. get on out of here. Yeah. Yep. Just passing. Just passing. Yes, sir. Ah. Gravy. Yeah, we're good. It was just sort of fun. I am totally good. Yeah, we're good. Those turns come up on you quick. Okay. Go on the hot brake, please. Okay. Yes, sir. On the hot brake. Right. All right. All right. Oh, yeah, baby. We're back in action. Woo! Holy smokes. Oh, wow. That was incredible. <laughs> drastically, drastically different, I would say, than before dinner. <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know how well the GoPro showed it, but Gravy straight up took me and a, and a wonderful older lady from the UK <laughs> out. I'm so glad we did wow. that. that was, also, wow. I've never seen a mustache stickle. I've also <laughs> never been a, a white, white mascara kind of guy, but, you know. <laughs> There's a new days for everything. <laughs> 2024. Wow. Jeez Louise. Yeah. We were able to sleep in the ice hotel last night, but we we're also at the world's largest ice hotel. We're in the Arctic Circle in Sweden. We have one hour until they close all the rooms up for the night. New people are gonna come in. So we're gonna explore all 20 something rooms in an hour and see what all these ice sculptures have created. After you. Wow. I'm very sorry. Welcome about to that. America. Welcome to the biggest ice hotel in the world. Sorry about that. All right, Gravy, this is the lobby of the ice hotel. Oh, the main hall. The main hall. 50 foot? Giant room, solid ice. We have around 20 rooms. We got to speed run them. We're going to rate each room one to 10 on the gravy scale. Give this room a nice little solid eight. I agree. Strong eight. I like the temples. It reminds me of like an organ at church. It does look like an organ. You ever been to like a Methodist church? I on the organ, there's yeah. like, bah, the whole service. Yeah, and there's yeah. like, all right, it's an organ service. Got an old service. dude playing that thing with his feet. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Codex Maximus. This one's cool. Take a seat with me, dude. Your own couple of those. Can't tell if that's like hot dogs over a fire or if those are slingshots. <laughs> Could be some type of cat. Okay. We're, Wonderlust. Ooh, put the word lust in it. Dude, this one's kind of wild. Oh, dude. Okay. I kind of like what I'm seeing here. That is immaculate. The way they put the lighting in there is so cool. Yes. Oh my gosh. What is that? Okay, what is this? That looks like. Can I ask what these two things are? Butt cheeks, brother. And what is this running through the butt cheeks? That's a, it's a tail and it's spinal. I mean, that's a full on man with a scorpion tail. <laughs> a solid nine. Nine. I'd say nine. It would be 10 if there wasn't as much man butt in here. What the world? The heck is that? I guess I see that it's a man it's... seeing himself, but what a man. That dude is just running through a block of eyes. <laughs> this is uh, mighty interesting. Can't tell if we're like at a funeral or we're watching a woman sleep. I feel like we're watching a woman sleep. A six. A six just because I feel weird. All right, sweet. The 12. Sana Luca Ron Coroni. You ever sat in a hot tub made of ice? No. <laughs> I don't understand. Is this the moon? You think this is the moon? 
a bunch of different slivers of it. I don't know. I think I could see that. What are you giving it? Well, that concludes our room tour. I will say, it's quite remarkable what people can do with ice. Yeah. Also, we're in a hotel right now, and they have like eight layers on. Wow. Still not getting used to the fact that it's 20 degrees in here. Gravy's loving the cold. Yes. No. Name a little. Mmm. Kind of a bucket list moment right here. We were bucket just, list moment. Wow. Everybody wants to go see the Northern Lights. What man. is that about? Is something like super impressive? I never heard of it until I just up. <laughs> For the first time in everyone involved in our crew's lives, we've seen the Northern Lights. Which is cool, dude. It's cool, dang it. <laughs> It's really cool. What was your react like jumping in the sky? We found Northern Lights. Check that off the list, Daddy. I'll check you off the list. How's negative 16 feel? Feels amazing. You don't even feel it, do you? No, I don't. You could live here, right? Yeah, yeah. He's a changing man. The final thing on the agenda of this luxurious Arctic vacation, we have some ice sculpting. Ice sculpting? Yeah, since we were so dang tough on all the sculptures, we're gonna see how me and Gravy fare at taking a cube of ice and making it look majestic. We're all gonna use the chisel. We always hold it like this, because if you do this or hold like this, you might hit yourself, injure yourself, and we don't want that. Are you going to give us some ideas of what to make? I want to say I've seen 4,000 hearts so far. <laughs> <laughs> I would say stay away from hearts, because we already have a lot of them. You are a natural, brother. Oh wow, she's coming out now. What are you going for? I don't even know what's happening. I'm just, I'm just here. You gotta visualize something first, bro. I'm just in the moment. What are you going for? Good, no idea. <laughs> Gravy, let's not loogie in here. I had to, I had to. Can be honest with you, I already have to. <laughs> That's so satisfying, dude. Sure. Dang, gravy. Yeah. You really should figure out what you're doing before you just grind all this down to. I'm just grinding hard. <laughs> What's the vision, dude? What do you want to make? Basketball. You want to make basketball? Yeah. Is this a surprise? I don't know what I'm doing yet either. <laughs> what is we should have Googled easiest thing to carve. Yeah, that, we might have should have done some homework. We definitely forgot our homework. Well, it's probably that one of you decided to make a fish. All right, I'll try. I'll take you on. Just because you said that I'm making a fish. Okay, I'm making a fish. Get in there, yeah. It's coming together, man. Oh, is it? Oh, <laughs> oh, it's happening. I'm making you a heart. <laughs> oh, thank kidding. you so much. <laughs> oh, wow. What's happening here? Okay, she just comes apart. That's good. Is dude. everything you do a surprise? Do what? Is everything you do a surprise uh, yourself? A surprise? Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're just... You should see us use the bathroom. <laughs> okay, what is this happening? Hey, wow. Oh, I wish you didn't hear that one. I tried to abandon ship, but. Yeah, that, that wasn't a oh, good wow. redirection. That was like a half back oh, toss that she lost like 20 yards on. Thanks, Gravy. You make that piece of ice your own, Gravy. Oh, there she is. Oh, I might be getting a face out of this. Kind of when you're mad at your ex-wife, just kind of go in. How many ex-wives do you have? I heard you had about two. I got one. We don't bring it up. 
All right, Gravy, it's been one hour. We have a plane to catch. Let me see your sculpture. I have a volcano here. I thought there was basketball. She turned into a volcano at the end okay. of the day. It's a volcano erupting. My UK friend here, she voted volcano and had a kid over Thank here. Thank you very much. Vo volcano. Beautiful work, good sir. Hopefully our guide lets me out. Hopefully I pass the class. Did we get graded on this? Yeah. We do, okay. Well, I mean, won't let you out until it's good enough. Okay. Yeah. Syllabus said that you had to have like 110 to pass class. I have a largemouth bass exploding through the water, mouth open, preferably a dragonfly up here, I like to imagine. Two-hander to hold her up, like what we catch back home. Giant golf ball eyeballs. And then we did leave a little bit of some tummy on her. You know we love some tummy on yeah, some girls. Yeah, she's a girthy girl. I would give a, uh, let's go one to 10, a solid seven. Thank you, that bro. Was, that's pretty good. Gravy. You slept on an Arctic overnight train. Mm -hmm. You slept in an ice hotel. Mm -hmm. You've gone dog sledding? Gone dog sledding, yeah. You've sculpted ice sculptures. Will you go fishing with me on a cold day now? Wow. <laughs> Still don't know about that one. She's outdoors. We tried. We did. Pretty little boo thing.